We're here in Las Vegas at Angel Park. We've caught up with Todd Kuyper. Todd, you came to the club today with uh, no golf clubs. And I hear you uh, perhaps have a special announcement about your future in the game of golf. Do you care to elaborate? Well, it is what it is. I'm pretty disgusted with golf in general, and I don't think I'm ever going to play golf again. So are you telling me on this day that you're considering retirement from the game? That's exactly what I'm saying, Craig. And, you know, it is what it is. Standing around golf courses for six hours, waiting for high handicappers to hit their crappy shots. And then I hit a crappy shot because of them. It's not me, it's them. I'm playing with guys that I don't necessarily like. Um, and playing for them. And I'm sick of them. I, I got better things to do. Do you feel you've just kind of lost your passion for the game? Absolutely. Well, you know, you, you kind of run a lot of the golf events, you know, around the United States. What kind of impact might this have on the Miami Golf Invitation? Well, when I walk from golf, I walk from all those events as well. And, you know, my most favorite are probably the Miami Golf Invitational. I think it's, uh, I think it's over. Do you think the tournament can succeed without you? I got it. You? It would be a tough challenge. It would certainly be, uh, be a sadly missed if it was to go away. Well, I do love the, the golf invitational down in Miami. I love the people there. I love all of my friends down there. But it comes a time when you know, enough's enough, and I think I think it's I think it's over down there. So I'm gonna spend my time doing other things, more productive things. Well, thanks for spending a few minutes with us. We hope you reconsider. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck. We are live with Craig Galino. Craig, I'm sure that um, this is a tough moment for you. What do you? How are you feeling? I can't believe it. I just can't believe it. It's can't, I can't believe it's possible. My my one passion in life is the Miami Golf Invitation, and he's going to take that away from me. I can't go any further. I can't go any further. You obviously need a moment. It's a lot like the breakup of Tiger and Stevie Williams. Can, can, can you foresee a future in your world without Todd Kuyper? I don't know. I mean, at least Stevie's found another winner. I don't know if there's another winner like Todd out there. It's, uh, it's going to be tough. It's going to be tough for me. I'm going to recommend you seek some counseling, and hopefully we'll see you again soon. Thank you. Thank you. Alan, Mr. Grant. We've caught up here with Alan Grant on the uh, putting range at Angel Park. Have you heard the news? I have heard the news. It's disturbing. Uh, you know, Tom is a great champion. Uh, we've walked a lot of rounds together. Uh, you know, he's won his fair share. Uh, you know, I certainly have more money in my pocket playing him than he does playing me. But uh, yeah, he's a great champion. He, uh, you know, he struggled with the chips and the putts for years, but that confidence of his really willed him to a lot of wins and obviously from you know what you've heard in the news CNN and the golf channel he's uh, he's lost his confidence in the game uh, I don't think this retirements forever I think he'll be back in 2012 but uh, will he be back to his old form I doubt it do you think he'll be back in time for the Miami Golf Invitational of 2012 I think with enough sponsorship dollars, uh, I think Todd will be back uh, for, for one finale in Miami as a, as a big send-off. It's certainly going to affect the economy down there. Um, you know, this is a big, it's a big tournament every year down there. 
Do you think uh, if he shows back up, do you think he'll break 80 at that course down now, there? No, I, I haven't seen Todd break 80 in the better part of a decade. Um, Legitimately. I, I think uh, he's going to basically become a... Uh, a 75-year-old Arnold Palmer that's going to come out and shoot his, you know, hit a ceremonial tee shot about 85 yards dead right, and then he's going to uh, walk back into the clubhouse. I think that's that's the image you're going to see. I don't think you want to remember Todd that way, but that's the last image that you're going to have. Thank you for your time. Thank you. Putt. Todd Kuyper needs this long putt to push the match to another hole. About 15 feet. <laughs> oh no, that is woefully short. Disgusted. He's still got like 10 feet.